All right, guys, welcome back to another reaction video. We are back once again with uh, our good old friend Med Rose. Now, this one is um, also a bit of an older one, but the sound of the title is just really enticing to me. This here is called The Social Agony of Mishearing People. Now, we have done uh, the people saying multiple things at once videos and i think this could be a pretty similar case a pretty similar experience here so i thought this was going this was going to be pretty entertaining and yeah without further ado let's let's start as always original video link is in the description he is huh yeah he's He's slowly getting there to 1 million. Um, so if you want to help him with that, link is in the description. Um, everything is set up. All right. In that case, let's get going. Okay, here we go. I will never forget the time when I was in high school. I went over a boy's house I was dating. He asked me if I wanted to see his ferret, but I okay. thought he said parrot. So I asked him, ferret, does it talk? <laughs> I went to okay, that could be worse. A workout class tonight, and the girl at the front desk said first name, but I thought she said first time, so I just replied no and stared at her. My co worker. Uh... Uh, yeah, that's one of those uncomfortable situations that you only later on realize what you just did. Okay, asked how my life is, but I thought he asked how my leg is, and I said, mm, it only hurts when I pay attention to it. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah. I don't think your answer was that wrong, to be honest. Who knows? It Who really knows? It hurts when I pay attention to it. Y'all, I'm so stupid. Today the doctor asked me how I felt on a scale of 1 to 10, but I thought okay. he asked something completely different. So I said, uh, email. Just had a conference call. With wait, 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 girl. What did you think he said? I thought he asked something completely different. But what did he ask you in your in your mind at least? That's what I wanna know. Oh. Huh. Just had a conference call with a potential client and she apologized for the background noise from her daughter, but I yeah. thought she said dog. So I asked what breed it was. Oh Awkward. Oh my god, what the fuck? Yesterday, some guy said, I like your freckles, but I thought he said fragrance. Okay. So I said, don't smell me. This. Oh. Oof. Dude at my new job said he was in the middle of a divorce, but I thought he said he lived in the middle of a forest. And I was like, yo, that's sick. Worth. <laughs> Wait, you're breaking up with your wife? Yo, that's awesome. What the fuck? The best thing that's ever happened to me is when the optician told me to have a look round in my new glasses. But okay. I thought he said, have a walk round. So I did a lap of the opticians like I was in a fucking shoe shop. A woman. Yeah, that is awkward. That is super awkward. But to be fair, if you want to know if your new glasses work, walking around in them might be a decent way to look at the to to figure it out because if you're walking around and you're stubbing your toes every single time you you walk that should probably be a decent indication that your glasses aren't working and ran past me and said another gray day but i thought she said have a great day and so i said mm, you too i asked for a pinot what? grigio at the airport and this man said oh, i have some in your blanc but i thought he Okay. He said, oh, I have 71 Pinot Grigios. So I said, you have 71 Pinot Grigios. And then we were both confused and he made me a mimosa. I well, that was a trip. 
walked past a girl in the toilet last night and she called me pretty, but I thought she said it's so dirty and I laughed and said, yeah, I know. Oh. Oh, man, no. Now it's gonna feel like you're an idiot. Now you're gonna feel like an arrogant piece of shit. Ah. Uh. Love you. Shut up, baby, I know it. Girl at work asked me for a mint, but I thought she asked if I had a man, so I was like, yeah, and showed her a picture of my boyfriend. My hearing's so bad, oh. someone told me, you cut the queue in Tesco, but I thought he said, your coat is cute, so I told him, oh, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that must have been a, quite, a, quite the exchange. One time, in second grade, we were reading a book about a deaf boy, and my teacher was like, why can't he hear? But I thought she said, dead boy! So I raised my hand and was like, he can't hear because, because he can't, he's not, he's not a hear anymore. And she was like, ah, I will never forget. Oh. Oh, that is painful. Ah. That is one of those things you're going to keep thinking back on, like, years afterwards. Why did I say that? Uh. During a hookup, the guy asked me to show my ass, but I thought he said hands. So I did a little jazz hands score emoji. My Uber burped, but I thought he said something to me. So I said, sorry, what? At the pool. And a guy asked me to help him grab his bottle of water. But I thought he asked okay. me to help him out of the water, and I went to pick him up. This girl said her grandma had six strokes, but I thought she said jokes, and I laughed. Oh my god, you good. Oh. You will love. Oh my god. Oh, that is so awkward. Ugh. Her grandma had six strokes, but I thought she said jokes and I laughed. Bro, imagine the situation. You're telling someone about it, and they just start laughing like, oh, your grandma, lol. Ouch. That, I think that's the worst one so far. Oh my god. The fact you thought someone grandma having precisely six jokes was normal was even weirder. A guy asked me if he had any <laughs> prostate meds, but I thought he said frosted flakes, so I brought him to the cereal aisle. The doctor was like, how much coughing are you doing? But I thought she said, how much coffee are you doing? Okay, yeah. I think both are questions that the doctor would ask. So I said, well, I work at Starbucks. And she said, <laughs> Okay. Fuck me. Bruh. The cashier said, have a nice day, but I thought she said namaste, so I said namaste back. Once yeah. That's... Again, that's one of those situations you're gonna keep thinking back on a long, long time. But they themselves, they're probably gonna forget about it by the end of the day. Time someone asked me what my favorite meme of the year was, but I thought they said meme, and I said, Oh, the one with the guy singing and falls out of the tree. <laughs> this guy says to me, Is <laughs> wait a what? I legit have never seen that meme before. What the? <laughs> This guy says to me, it's windy, huh? But I thought he said Wendy, so I replied, no, no, it's Danielle. Today at Chick-fil-A, the cashier asked Bruh. for my name, but I thought he asked for my order. So I said, my name is, is, is Spicy D, the nerd. Oh. <laughs> oh, I was not ready for that. My name is Spicy D. Sp is Spicy D <laughs> the nerd? <laughs> uh, that was good.
Okay, that was a good one. My name is Spicy D. Bruh. <laughs> asked me for my height and weight, but I thought she asked me to wait. So we just sat there staring at each other for a minute. Never oh. forgetting that time, a customer called and said she'd lost her husband and... Uh-oh. ...needed to report it. But I thought she said she'd lost her bank card, so I went, no, no problem. I'll get you a new one sent out. Someone in work... <laughs> Whoops. Work asked me what my favourite creepy pasta was, but I thought he said creamy pasta, so I said I mean I don't know if that is is that a normal exchange at work to ask your colleague what your favorite creepy pasta is? I don't know, I've never had this conversation at work before. What about you guys? Spaghetti carbonara? When I work Well, spaghetti carbonara can be pretty creepy. It's also pretty delicious. But who knows? Depending on who prepares it and who how they prepare it. It might be creepy, I don't know. To Jack, someone had asked me if we had Apple Pay, but I thought she said Apple Pies. So I said Apple Pay? No, no. But we got cheesecakes, my teacher. At least we have that. You want to pay with your phone? Nah. But we have cheesecake, so... I told someone, you're not a bother, but I thought she said father when I tell you I was confused. You are not a bother. <laughs> Answered the phone at work, guy said, is this Josh Finkelstein? But I thought he said, this is Josh Finkelstein. So I paused and said, how can I help? And he replied, so you are Josh Finkelstein. And I said, no, I'm not Josh Finkelstein. I thought you were Josh Finkelstein. Someone just asked me if I had a good... Oh. Yeah, that is an awkward exchange. Ugh. Good heart, but I thought he said guitar, so I said no. One for the guy. Someone just asked me if I had a good heart. In what sense? Are we talking physical wise or like, are you a nice person? That's also a very weird question to ask someone if you, if you ask me. No, one of the guys working on my basement asked for toilet paper, but I thought he said tall people. So I said, it's just me, dog. Oh, that is pain. That is actual pain. Last but not least, I just called the bank, and to confirm my identity, the okay. rep asked if I had any loans, but I thought she said drones. Okay. And I was like, um, no, I have a camera on my phone that sometimes I take to a broom to get aerial shots, but I don't have a drone. And the poor rep was like, okay. Posted the last second. I don't want to. I don't want the next video to start playing. Uh, that was a bit of a trip. No, the last one. Okay, awkward, but not that bad. Which one was it? Which one was it? Here, yeah, Spicy D. Spicy D has got to be my favorite today. What's your name? Spicy D. They call me D. Spicy D. <laughs> like at this point, that's gotta be your nickname. That's gotta be your new game attack, bro. I'm Spicy D. Oh, man. Okay, that was good. That was quite the nice laugh that we had. As always, that rose delivered. Um, I hope you guys had as much fun as I did. That was quite jokes. If you have some suggestions for other videos, let me know in the comment section down below. Um, thank you for watching. I hope you guys have a great day. And maybe I'll see you, or hopefully I'll see you in another video on my channel or perhaps during one of my live streams. So until then, take care, have a great day and bye.